This is the interface that's on the PC as opposed to the iPad. You can see that I can create touch casts in a similar way. I'll create a map cast this time. My map cast is going to be at Parameter. Now the first thing I need to do is I need to load a background picture. On my desktop, I've got a folder called Ermington. And in there I've put a map of the bike paths around the Parramatta River. I'll use that as my background. Next, I want to add a VAP or a VAP. I'm going to add a map. A Google map of the area around the Novotel or Parramatta. So I'll look for Ermington because the bike path goes up to the Parramatta River just down the road here. Let's preview that. And that's exactly what I want. I'll add that to our video. Now, I want this map to come in at zero seconds and to go out, I don't want it to sit there taking up the whole screen for the whole time, I'm going to tell it to go out after eight seconds. I'm also going to tell the map that if anyone clicks on the map, I want the video to pause. So it's going to come in at zero and it's going to go out at eight seconds. I'll add another VAP too, or VAP. I'll add some pictures, so that's media. In that Ermington folder, I've got a picture of the ferry. I'll use that. And I'll tell that to come in after nine seconds, because the map is going to stay there for eight. And I'll tell the ferry to go out after 12 seconds. I'm not going to get it to pause. I could, however, make it a link. I'll add another VAP, some more media, and we'll grab a picture of someone on a bicycle on the bike path. So that picture there we'll add to the video, and we'll pop that over there too, and we'll tell it to come in after 12 seconds although I do need to check what this one's doing. That's coming, going out after eight. And the ferry was going out after 12, yep. So we'll tell the, the bike to replace the ferry, so it will come in at 12 seconds, and it'll go out at 17 seconds and I'll have a link for this one as well. So I'm going to tell the link to be I'm done. So now it's a matter of doing my recording. When we click here these appear and disappear and then the timings will bring them in when they're needed. So let's record. Parramatta River runs from Parramatta to the city. There are bike paths along the river. There's also a ferry service. 
So if you were to ride your bicycle along the path, you don't have to ride there and back. You could pop your bike on the ferry, go to Parramatta, and ride to one of the many places along the river for an enjoyable afternoon. I'm done. Parramatta River runs from Parramatta to the city. So now it's just previewing it for me. The river. There's also a ferry service. So if you were to ride your bicycle along the path, you don't have to ride there and back. You could pop your bike on the ferry, go to Parramatta, and ride to one of the many places along the river for an enjoyable afternoon. I'm happy with that, so I'll save it. Find the right thumbnail and click on broadcast. It's now connecting to the Touchcast website. It'll upload that file and when it's done anyone would be able to watch it with a link.